comes to art, I don't want to be the the person that everybody's like drawn to see. I want people to go there to see something else and then stumble upon it because that's what's more exciting to me. Yeah. I remember how that made me feel when you go somewhere, you go see it, like, oh yeah, okay, cool. But then when you find that hidden gem, yeah, it's, like, it's way more special than the one that you're actually searching for, you know what I mean? So that's what I would much rather want to be. out on my own, but I haven't opened this book since the 90s. That's crazy. Yeah, so it's an artist by the name of Bev Doolittle, and when you look at her artwork, she hides things. For instance, this is, all you're supposed to see is trees, yeah. you look, you can see the Native American and their horses. Yeah. And, like you can see the fox, another horse. Hell yeah. But so but you look back, yeah. you won't see none you won't of that. See none of it, yeah. And like like this one. You see trees, but there's a big ass bear staring you in your face. It's so It's literally like hidden in like <laughs> yeah, plain sight. Plain bro. sight. So putting things like right there for you to see and like this is the kind of stuff like I'm trying to put together all of the influences that my mom, my dad, all of them that, had, you know, installed in me because still to, to this day they're so Just because you buy that brush, just because you buy that camera, just because you buy that fabric, that don't mean you're going to make something good out of it. Right. That, that All of that comes from this, like this and this. Like you, your hands have built up that callus, yeah. you know what I mean? And that's the only way that you're going to hold on to your dream is through that failure. So you got to sit up there, you got to have that damn, you got to have all that callus on your hands to be able to hold on to your dream. That's what you're, that's the reason why you struggle. Yeah. To be able to have that thick skin to hold on to. And that's what art does, it's trial and error, trial and error, trial and error, trial and error, you know. And then at the end of the day, wherever that goes, and you can bring that into that body. And now what it looks like Perspiration, sweat, energy, all of that. That's what you get just off of that moving, that movement, just like that. Uh -huh. like you get that, like I could never taps. She knows that I ain't doing what I'm supposed to be doing. <laughs> but that never happens. <laughs> This is therapeutic. It started off as therapeutic. Yeah. You know what I mean? And it and it it saved me, it saved my family, um, it saved my career, it saved, you know. I gotta credit it all because it's it's just I needed it more than anything. Yeah. You know, and like even now it's just like 